Welcome to Wellsboro High School's one-to-one -one intro video. In this short video, we will be taking you through the highlights of the district's laptop policy and the laptop's use and care. Here's a quick rundown of the district-issued laptop policy. Please be sure to fully read and understand the policy and accompanying documents before signing the agreement. In order to have a laptop assigned to a student, the student and parent or guardian must sign the agreement for district laptop use, which states that you have read, understood, and agreed to the terms of the agreement for the district laptop use and the Wellsboro Area School District Policies 815, the Acceptable Use of Internet, 815.2, District Issued Laptops, and Policy 249, Bullying slash Cyberbullying Policy. To take the laptop off campus, a $50 non-refundable one-time fee is required. Generally, this fee will cover most accidental damage to the laptop while in the student's possession. However, the student or guardians may be responsible for any repairs necessary for repeated accidental, negligent, or intentional damage, loss, or theft of the laptop. Should a repair be necessary, the student should bring a laptop to the help desk in the Library Media Center as soon as possible. If a repair cannot be made right then, the student will receive a loaner laptop while the necessary repairs are made, assuming a loaner is available. The student's laptop will be returned as soon as possible once the repairs are complete. If a laptop is lost or stolen, the student must immediately complete a laptop missing slash stolen report form and submit it to the building principal. A copy of the form is attached to the policy documents as attachment 4. At that point, the district may activate the use of remote tracking technology for the specific purpose of locating the laptop. As required by the Children's Internet Protection Act, the district filters all internet traffic while on campus. While off campus, there is a basic filter in place to block the worst sites, but parents and guardians should monitor the student's web usage. The laptops may be accessed remotely while on any Wellsboro Area School District campus. This would include IT technicians taking control to perform support-related functions and teachers connecting or viewing the screens to perform class management functions. No one in the district will ever remotely connect to a student's laptop outside the district's network. No district employee will ever remotely activate or monitor the laptop's webcam or microphones for any reason. The laptop is set subject to the same search and seizure rules as any other district property. The district may look at student files when the laptop is turned in at the end of the school year or when a laptop is returned permanently, such as when the student withdraws. The district may look at the files when there is a reasonable suspicion the student has been violating district policies. For instance, if a student asks for help and a staff member sees inappropriate files on the laptop. The student files may also be accessed if a laptop is reported missing or stolen and a consent form is signed by the student and or parent and guardian. The students will be allowed to take the laptop home for the summer, save a brief period for the IT department to run any necessary hardware and software maintenance on the laptops. This privilege may be taken away from a student for violating the law, district policies, or the school's code of conduct. A student's failure to abide by the rules of the district laptop policy will be subject to the discipline as stated in the student code of conduct. Now for the best practices when dealing with the laptops. The student is responsible for the appropriate use of the laptop both in school and at home. The district is providing a laptop for educational purposes and it should be treated as a necessary school supply. It should be charged every night so its battery can make it through the school day. Students should not bring their charger to school with them. We will have some extras available if their battery dies unexpectedly, but again, it is the responsibility of the student to charge their laptop each night. Students will not have administrative rights to install traditional programs, but you will have the rights to install software from the Windows Store and from district-provided sources. You may copy legally licensed movies, music, and other media to the laptop. However, illegally obtained media or software is expressly prohibited on the devices. Any personal media stored on the laptop is the student's responsibility to back up. During the normal yearly refresh, the data may not be backed up by district IT staff and may be deleted from the laptop. The laptop always remains property of the Wellsboro Area School District. We are entrusting the laptop to the students as a learning tool. Students should not mark up or personalize the laptop in any way. The laptop should be kept at roughly room temperature. Very warm or very cold temperatures can damage it. The laptop shouldn't get wet or be left in a vehicle. It also shouldn't be closed in a case while being left on. Always put the laptop to sleep or shut it down before closing it in its case. Normally, closing its lid will put it to sleep. Take reasonable precautions to keep your laptop safe to prevent theft or loss. If storing it in your locker, make sure your locker is locked. 
When carrying your laptop, use the district provided case. If set up properly, the laptop can remain in the case at all times, even when in use. Make sure to zip the case closed before picking up the case with the laptop in it. The laptop can slip out if it's not zipped completely. If you're having problems with the laptop and need assistance, check in with the help desk in the Library Media Center or Technology Office. Be safe while online. Take a critical eye to emails and other offers. If it sounds too good to be true, it probably is. We will not ask for your passwords or any confidential information such as your bank accounts or social security number. Don't fill this information in on any web forum. Do not tamper with or bypass the built-in web filter. It helps keep you safe online from inappropriate content as well as scams and malware. Be mindful online. Be mindful of what you say. If you wouldn't say it to someone in person, why would you say it to them online? Wellsboro Area School District will not tolerate online bullying. Be mindful of what you post. Once it's out there, it's always out there. Keep in mind that when posting things, be it words, pictures, or anything else, what you post today may come back to haunt you tomorrow. Be mindful of others. If you think another student is violating policies or the law with their laptop, say something to a staff member. For student-athletes, under no circumstances should your laptop be left on the field or in the gym during practices or games. Store them securely in your locker. Students are not permitted to take their laptops with them to away games. Make regular backups. The laptops will fail occasionally and your data may be lost as a result. Prevent that loss by making sure you have a backup. A perfect solution is to sync your data to Google Drive, but a thumb drive works well too. At the end of each school year, the laptop will be wiped and reloaded with current software. Student data will not be backed up. It is the student's responsibility to make a backup before returning the laptop to the IT department. Once again, syncing to Google Drive is the perfect solution. Start good habits. Always use the laptop's case. Close the lid before picking the laptop up to move it. Don't lay anything on the keyboard. If the lid gets closed, it may break the screen. Store the laptop on a stable, safe surface at home. The bed, the floor, or on a heater vent are not good examples of safe surfaces. Don't pile a bunch of stuff on your laptop. It could break the screen, hinges, or other parts. Protect the laptop from drops, food, spills, animals, and small children. And lastly, have some fun with the laptop. Be creative and make something extraordinary.